The Sheleftia model is the healthy firefighter's method for reducing the risk that firefighters are exposed to hazardous substances. The Sheleftia model is based on research and experience. When an alarm occurs, all clothing and equipment are decontaminated and functional after the previous alarm. The vehicle cabin is clean and free from contaminated material. Vehicle placement at the site is important in minimizing contamination. The commander should always use correct safety equipment when the site is being examined. Doors and shutters on vehicles should be closed when not in use. Even with external extinguishing, it is important to have close-fitting clothing, just as it is with indoor extinguishing and BA firefighting. Even personnel who only temporarily are near the fire or who perform tasks at a distance from the fire should have protection for respiration and skin exposures. Choose a suitable filter mask. Personnel involved in follow-up extinguishing, monitoring and or investigation should have access to respiratory and skin protection, such as close-fitted clothing and a filter mask. The possibility to perform a simple change of clothes following a completed mission is important since contact with contaminated clothing is then quickly eliminated. Since all protective clothing is individually packed with all accessories, everything can immediately be used again if the necessity should arise on the return trip to the station. All contaminated equipment is encapsulated prior to the return trip. Systematically encapsulating contaminated equipment protects the passenger cabin of the vehicle from hazardous substances. Thus, the cabin of the fire engine is a clean environment. Encapsulated, contaminated materials can be controlled and transported without contaminating the worksite. Contaminated hoses should be stored in water-filled, covered containers until they can be cleaned. All decontamination takes place in a separate locale from that used for other laundry. The room or rooms used for decontamination should include a ventilation system that generates negative pressure to prevent contaminated air from escaping the room. Turnout jacket and pants should be unpacked and prepared for laundering in a controlled manner. Gloves, helmets and boots can be cleaned in a dishwasher. Drying cabinets are used to keep the process quick and gentle. It is important to wash and shower as soon as possible after spending time in a contaminated environment. Decontaminated equipment is replaced and ready for the next mission.